Hello friends, my name is Ramasu. Today we shall discuss about a topic, the direct and manage project work process. Friend, today's topic is very very interesting, especially if you have interest in project management or you are planning to give exam or PMP in near future. So let's start. First of all, I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well, so that my new videos can reach to you. And also, you can follow me on the Facebook page as well. Friend, direct and manage project work is a project management process that allows you to lead a team, handle resources, and oversee the completion of a project. This process comprises executing a strategy planned by a project manager and managing its interfaces. It's necessary that this strategy consider unexpected events, unforeseen client requests, and changes in the project budget, <coughs> as these factors entail risks that can produce unplanned work. Applying the direct and manage process may help managers choose the best approach to address these issues and ensure the completion of the original project. They can do this by securing and handling enough resources such as employees, technology, and money, and uh, pre-established company procedures and industry standards. By doing this, they guarantee similar results throughout through. Out the project and avoid the risk of producing malfunctioning uh, products or poor quality services. Now, if we talk about the inputs uh, for the direct and manage project work, the input are a project management plan. That means any component of the project management plan may be the input uh, for this process. Project documents like change log, lesson learned register, milestone list. Project communication, project schedule, requirement traceability matrix, risk register, and risk report. Approved change requests like corrective action, preventive action, defect repair, enterprise environmental factor, or which includes organizational structure, infrastructure, stakeholder risk threshold, uh, organizational process assets, which includes the organizational policies, issue and defect management, performance management change control and project information so these are the tools now if you talk about the, uh, the these were the inputs and now if you talk about the tools which includes the expert judgment meetings and project management information system pmis the output of the whole process of direct manage project work are uh, deliverables so if you talk about deliverable basically uh, deliverables are is any unique and verifiable product result or capability to perform a service that is required to be produced to complete a process phase or a project next is the work performance data that means the raw observations and measurements identified during activities being performed to carry out the project work the issue log the uh, change request project management plan updates project document updates and the organizational process asset updates so all these seven are the output of direct and manage project work so friend uh, thank you thanks a lot for watching the video i hope you like this video if you like it please share it with your friends and colleagues and thanks a lot for watching the video